Hello everybody and welcome back to Exploring 1.19 and today I am joined by Warlord1987 not totally wasn't facing the wrong direction So it's been a minute since Warlord's joined us and he's oh, done he's done a lot of work without me I yeah although ironically most of these projects only literally took maybe an hour <laughs> it didn't take that long. Most of the days was actually spent AFKing the potato farm and selling it for profits. By the way, pre-release 2, the villager bug is finally fixed. <sighs> too long, too long. Too long was that in the game. So yeah, we are one step closer to full release and one step closer to Optifine, which is going to be excellent. Even though Optifine can cause problems and potentially get you killed, even. Which. I've seen it happen, actually. Um, I shouldn't have broke that. I need to craft the. Uh... Here, have a boat. Hmm, yeah. Well, anywho. Yeah, your boat's right here. Yeah, I'll just give you my old boat. Anywho, today we are going to be taking on a... a we're going to kill a dragon. <laughs> Simply put. Um, Warlord? Yes? If you look in this chest, you will find a lot of useful items. Mainly the slow falling potions, which I'd recommend keeping on the entire fight. Yeah. And I don't really have any blocks in huge quantities that I can take to stack up with except dirt. And I got you covered. Gobble son. Diorite. Um, I hit, I hit a huge vein. Oh, that's nice. Uh, my inventory's full. Oh. <laughs> Completely stuffed to the brim. Um, I need to fix that actually, cause I, I want golden, I want golden apples. So I'm gonna leave the nine dirt behind. Get my sixty-four golden apples out. <laughs> I did a lot of work off camera, okay? Uh, oh yeah, I've also got pumpkins in here. Which need to be sheared. I'm going to go ahead and unequip my helmet. And switch it out for a pumpkin. Let's see, what else? And beds. We need at least one bed. I got I have a bed. Did you just grab yours from your house? No. Alright. That, that there was a spare. Is there more pumpkins? Yeah, this one's here is already sheared for you. Oh, okay. Uh did you grab your slow falling potions? No. Yes. No, I grabbed two. Each one's four minutes four minutes apiece. I, I would take the golden carrots because the saturation bonus is really worth it. Uh, do you have enough, enough? Do you have enough arrows? A stack and ten. All right. Uh, if you need more, you feel like you need more, the the, the mob farm. There's a little yeah. bit of everything up there: flesh, gunpowder, zombie villager heads, um, armor. <laughs> Swords, shovels, potatoes, carrots, gold ingots, <laughs> iron ingots. A lot. There's a lot of random sh shit up there. Most useful is gunpowder. Okay, so... Oh. We want to be going... That's technically north... Northeast. 
I, ne I never in my wildest dreams imagined that the stronghold would be this way. <laughs> I thought it would be that way. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that, but I did. But yeah, basically to cut this, or save on time, I'm going to pause, and I'll see you when we get there. Alright, alright, we're recording. Um, so, just as a little side note in our journey... Uh, on the day of the recording, it is National Tur International Turtle Day. So... Not yeah. turtle enough for the turtle club? I just thought we'd... Hey, this was actually Warlord's idea, so thank him for this. <laughs> but <laughs> I just saw turtles and went international turtle day. <laughs> I figured it'd be funny, you know. Yeah. Okay, so here's a scenic shot of some turtles on International Turtle Day. My question to everybody is: Are you turtly enough to to subscribe? Maybe. I hope so. Anyway, I'll see you guys at the stronghold. Okay. I'm not above law, am I? No. Okay. no. I, I mean, obviously not. But, uh, we're here. Bazinga! As Duke Nukem would say. That's the staircase. Uh, so we just gotta basically hope that it's not gonna be behind a wall like it can be and typically is anymore. But it's typically always five rooms from the entryway. Uh, um, I'll take iron. Ooh, that's... Is it behind another wall again? <laughs> oh, no. It probably is. I took those doors out, by the way. Oh, that's a dead end. It was. Oh, so I guess it it wasn't a bug that when you get hit, your armor makes a sound. Um, Permanent new fixture. Every time you lose durability on your armor, it makes a sound. So put your bed down. Oh, it's actually night. <laughs> But I actually want to do a little bit of housekeeping before we actually enter the uh, end. I want to first go up to the surface and build a pillar so we can at least find this place again. And I'm going to craft a bunch of ladders so we don't have to dig down every time. Can you pick up those planks on the ground behind you? Yeah. Cool, cool. This isn't going to be the most pretty thing, but... It's going to be very functional. Oh, there's a zombie down there busting through a door. Oh, that's just Dave. Dave's fine. There's a creeper, locked up, as he should be. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I agree. Creepers should not be free to roam the earth. As they blow up and ruin everyone's perfect houses.
It's kind of funny that there's an Enderman literally right next to the stronghold. <clears throat> yeah, this is just good housekeeping, and you don't have to build a pillar. You don't have to build a pillar next to the stronghold. I just do it because I can note down the coordinates and then use the pillar to find the exact place. I need to get the coordinates. For this. So, F3. Um... Stronghold is negative... 284 negative 1695 and instead of a binder I've now condensed all this and all this into a notebook so it actually fits on my desk properly ladder system is dangerous. Aside from just being one of the most impractical things you'll probably ever see, so I'm just gonna... No, that's fine. I'm just gonna block the um, non-important ways up. Light the area up a bit better. Ha! <laughs> uh, okay. And boom. Oh, sweet! We got a two eye, so I didn't need all these extra eyes. But that's fine because these can be used for inner chest. All right, are you ready? Uh, yeah. Let me. Get some things situated here. Maybe I don't need that in the hot bar. Pumpkins on. All right. Good spawn. Uh, yeah, we're in the Box of Doom. Meaning, if you don't have a good pickaxe, you're going to have a bad time. So I'm going to immediately go up this pillar here. And start taking out the, uh, towers. Like it's cool. Oh shit. My bow aims not great. Got it. So I'll have to go over there and take that one out.
And then there's like one more in the cage. Wait. Have you gotten all the other towers down? Because I think all there's but one. Yeah, it's just that one in the cage there. I think I may have went over. Oh, you died. <laughs> I tried the bed. <laughs> yeah, that's not... I need to get a few ender pearls. This isn't going to take very long. Well, that pickaxe is gone. <laughs> mm, that's a slight uh -huh. loss only because we don't have diamonds, but... The golden apples are gone. Oof. <laughs> the sword is gone. I have no weapon. I'm not very good at hitting points in the air. With a bow, oh, you. I have a random Enderman aggroed on me. I don't know why. Armor's gone, bud. Yeah, I know. I was, I was, lost the helmet, lost the pants. I still had the chest plate and boots. Um. You, you can come back and get it if you want. Uh, I'm gonna grab this treasure map. Oh, it's literally right next to the village. Yeah, your stuff's right there. Uh, I've got your chest plate. Your chest plate and pants is right here. I killed the dragon and turn... I, I turn around at the exact moment you die. <laughs> oh. Well, dragon's dead. Um, I only used two golden apples, one golden carrot, and exactly, I died twice. <laughs> exactly none of the healing potions. So, <laughs> the whole bottom of the chest was, oh no! Um, 
Well, I'm gonna go back in and grab the dragon egg. Yeah. Because it... I hadn't thought about that. But there is a real easy way to get home from the stronghold that neither of us actually thought about. Last What's time that? we did this. Uh, destroy the bed, go into the end, and then go through the portal in here again. Because it'll teleport you to world spawn, which is literally right next to our village. Uh, the first enderman to hold dirt in the end. Oh, shit. Uh, we may have lost the dragon egg. Uh, what? Um, it went through the portal. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I knew that could happen. I didn't think it would happen. Um, it's not here. Um, I'm gonna hope it's at world spawn. Actually, no, I don't want to... Hang on, we got something else to do. Before we get out of here. Uh, I'm going to build a chest. And put that there, put that there, put that there, that there. Uh, trap doors. I would reset your spawn here. Actually, uh, Elytra. We already have mending. We just need to find a way to get unbreaking on it, which is going to be fun. That's actually cool. The portal thingy is right next to... see this happen very often where the gateway is right next to the uh... oh I moved I moved it's safe to go through okay so to prevent something that's happened a few times holy shit are you kidding me? It's hey. right there. <laughs> uh. Well, there's one Elytra. And then I only need three diamond blocks to craft another. Which, with fortune's really not going to be that hard. But the only thing we're really going to have problems with is unbreaking. Because I don't, I don't have a villager that trades that exactly just yet. So yeah, I'm going to pause until we get right next to it. And I'll catch you guys then. Alright, so we're basically right up on this thing. And I already... I'm defenseless. Oh, we just, we just, we just, we just bred shulker boxes. Oh, you're going to have to help me here, because if I get hit again, I'm going to. I have, I don't even have anything to help myself. Um. Are these dropping two shulker boxes each? I've got three so far. Uh, so no. That data pack is effectively broken.
<laughs> He's too stupid to know he can't shoot me. Oh, did we just get a shulker head? Yo. Like yes, we did. Uh, I got you a pair of diamond pants. I would not put them on, though. <laughs> Curse of binding. The curse of binding. Ooh. Yo, here. Uh, I have a sharpness three diamond sword. Uh, ooh. I'm actually. Did you get all the shulker shells that fell? I have seven. All right. Well, uh, we can craft more if we need them anyway. But I have something what? to defend myself with. Come here, bitches. Uh. Actually, having some ender pearls would be really advantageous right now. Oh shit, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh, come on guys, stop belching all over the place, that's just gross. Is he dead? I actually don't, don't kill him just yet. Yeah, he's dead. I'll let you get this. I'm gonna head on over to the end ship. Ah, uh, this was. Oh no! Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh yeah. So I'm just gonna do that. Then bridge over. Really? Okay, guys. All right, one of you. So, Toggle Crouch is not your friend. Uh, when going, when a levitation is applied. Or something. I almost died again.
If it would have happened, I would have seen me actually rage quit. Oh. Oh. I'm very close to do it, just doing it already. Nine shulker shells. Well, what's in here? Potion of healing in sale two. I already have a ton of those. Ooh. Oh, give me, give me, give me shulker shell. Give me shulker shell. Let me down. Give me beacon too. How about some diamond boots? And an efficiency diamond pickaxe. And a protection three, unbreaking three, thorns chest plate. But most importantly, that. And secondly, I have too much in my inventory. I'll get rid of that. Uh, you already hit the ship? Uh, ship has been successfully hit. so I don't need an instant health potion. Uh, actually, there's one thing over here that I don't really have space for. But I will make space for it because this is one of the only ways to get it. Um, dragon head. So, next all we need is another elytra. And we can... Bail. I'm glad I didn't jump off the back of this like I was getting ready to. That could have been bad. Oh! Feather falling saved my life. I didn't realize I was about to water bucket into the void. <laughs> I just tripped over. What? <laughs> levitating thing like Mario yeah well I'm gonna pause here guys we'll see you when we get to another city which shouldn't be long since we got basically the best render distance so yeah see you guys in a minute alright guys so uh, we weren't able to find another end city um, just the one so I threw my uh, trap doors away that wasn't the brightest move. I happened to find another end gateway. I realized after I was far I have, away that I didn't take I the coordinates for it. So. I'm just going to use this one that I found. Okay. And fail to get through it. Time to make 12 more trapdoors. Alright, I'm back at the main island. Go through the gateway when you're ready. I'm working on my way to get on over there. I'm gonna actually take down the notes of that gate or coordinates of that gateway so I can use it for reference next time. Okay, I'm here. 
All right, so time to use the fast travel trick. That is a nice shulker head. Wee. Joining world loading terrain. I have the coordinates to this place. I have an elytra, so I am perfectly fine with leaving the bed behind. Uh, woo. Alright, so what else are we doing? Uh, break your bed. Uh, keep it or put it in the chest. Go back into the end and then go through the portal in the end again and it'll take us back to world spawn. Whew, that's a lot of stuff said in one breath. I'm going to actually turn my uh, render distance back down. See if that helps performance. Oh! What? Sorry for the regular show style. Oh, we have the dragon egg. Here. Get the achievement. It went back to you. Did it? Oh. Is yeah. your inventory full? No. We'll put that next to the cake. Um, so base should be that way. Actually, we've come so we come a long way. We've come a long way. Cool. Let's revisit the first night shack, since we're all the way over here anyway. Oh yeah, it's up there, isn't it? Yeah, it's right here. This is where we spent the first night of this journey in this little hobbit hole right here. We should actually sit down and make a proper thing. I think this was a vein of coal that we just mined out for cobblestone and then when day yeah. came we went exploring and then never came back. Eh. <laughs> uh, it's been a while since I've seen that actually it may not seem like it with this being episode what episode is this I am doing correct eight frankly keep a track you do, you do a lot of you do, you do a lot of, you do a lot of recording without me so. yeah actually a lot of the stuff was done on you remember that day you had a migraine yeah most of it was done on that day that took like a six hour nap and I did, like, a six-hour work session. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that's when most of it occurred. I did one last night where I set up the village houses because... Well, the, the mending pickaxe was n nice while it was a thing. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to leave this boat over here. I just see the pearl go past. I was thinking, is that what I thought it was? Yes. <laughs> it was. Oh my, it is good to be back. So good to be back. Hi, Aaron Gall. How are you damaged? You should not be damaged. There's no way you took damage in here. By the way, v villagers make a lot of bread. Villagers make a lot of bread. Alright, you're about ready to wrap this up? Yeah, it's been 40 minutes. It's probably been like an hour and a half for us, while only 40 minutes. It's been two hours since we started like 7.30. Oh. 
Yeah, are you saying why? Are you seeing why I said like, are, are you not ready to end this? Because I, I got stuff, my, I got stuff on my channel I gotta do. <laughs> yeah. By the way, can I have your shoulder shells? Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, eighteen. Twenty-nine. Ah. Oh, Should have gotten forty more. Oh, uh, that's the grand total. I'm gonna put that in the resources chest because those are quite valuable. Uh, we have a beacon too. That's another reason I was looking for in ships because they spawn with beacons. Yeah. But sharp of sharpness three curse of vanishing. That that sucks. Efficiency five iron shovel. Frostwalker diamond boots. Yeah. One thing I think they should do is make it to where if you put an elytra on an enchanting table, you can put in breaking on it, at least. Actually, hang on. Before we end the episode, I'm going to put on breaking on my elytra. Or try to. If not, I can do it off camera. But I'm just going to enchant a bunch of random books real fast. And see what they come out to. Also, I think I said this off camera. I haven't said it on. I'm going to move this villager breeder. Or I'm going to move the breeder someplace else. And probably take this building as my house. Because it, it, it's too close to the actual villagers. They think that they don't detach from their beds. And it's causing problems. I will be back. I will be back. That's the ticket. Uh, so actually we got... Pull that one back. Pull that one. If we can get another one of those, we can have a sharpness four sword. Uh, that would be... Really nice, actually. Before this gets too late, the sun goes down, and bad things come out. Actually, I'm going to take and sell this off real fast, make some quick profits. That's about a little over a mending book because I was so desperate for mending I took an awful price one of those technically the truth moments I knew I could get it at a better price but I figured I'd better take it while I could get it so that's exactly what I did do I regret it? A little bit. 32 emeralds is a bit excessive for mending. Because I know you can get it cheaper than that. Like under 20 emeralds. Well, that sucks. My anvil from day one just broke. My, my anvil from day one broke. It's gone. Oh. Forever. Or not day one. Or is this still recording? Yeah. Because I need to call my dad back. Yeah, we're still going. Okay. But I just had to do this real fast. may not look like much 
but this has been a little over 100 days worth of progress. We... And I would normally just place this pumpkin down, but I've had an Enderman steal my, my Ender Dragon fight pumpkin before. <laughs> just walked up and took off with it. I, I guess these instant health potions are useless. Basically. Yeah... But, yeah. Okay, so, uh... I still, we, we can do that very treasure next time. Um, so, yeah. Future plans for this. Uh, there's one more thing I want to do with both of us in this world before I, uh, we close curtains on this. There's one, I've got my own personal goal of finishing this village up. But that last thing is visiting the Deep Dark. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I just thought of that. Just thought of that. Was it? Wither Oh, no. <laughs> Wither versus Warden? About a hundred wardens. <laughs> oh, God, there would be, yeah. Because <laughs> it just continuously set off the Shrieker. But, uh, yeah. Next... Next episode will probably be me, and I'll probably finish up this village because, yeah, I think it needs done. I, I This netherrack frame here is getting old to look at. But, yeah, after that, we will be t uh, taking on the Deep Dark. I am going to look at Chunk Base, see if it's updated to the snapshots, and see if I can't find a Deep Dark on that. Or an ancient city, because it, it, they can be kind of tricky. Actually, truthfully, I could just recreate this world, use the recreate feature, and then locate biome and do it that way. But it take way it take entirely too long to find it organically. So, Yeah, with that, I have been confined to 6881, joined by. And we'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.